So the second specialty epoxy that we have is called G-Flex epoxy. This is a two-part toughened epoxy system. This toughness makes it perfectly suited for bonding to difficult to bond to woods, dissimilar materials that are dimensionally unstable and areas that may experience shock or vibration. Some examples of difficult woods that G-Flex will bond to include teak, Ipe and white oak. It also will bond to dissimilar materials. This includes wood or composites to metals. It will also bond to many plastics. This includes high density polyethylene, which is very difficult to adhere to. But if I use a process that we call flame treating from a propane torch and move the flame quickly over the surface, it will change the surface energy from the gases coming off the flame and it will greatly improve your overall adhesion. As mentioned before, toughness is key to the epoxy success. G-Flex offers excellent adhesion because it can elongate before it fails, which leads to higher peel strength before it comes unbonded. It has high elongation, which leads to more flexibility and not being brittle. With G-Flex, it has an ultimate elongation of around 32% before it breaks. So now I want to demonstrate the toughness of G-Flex. So I'm going to set these aside. And what we have here is I have a casting of G-Flex that I'm gonna show you how impact resistant this is. So I'm gonna hit it with a sledgehammer and we'll show you that it's not brittle by any means. You can see that the puck of G-Flex can take that impact and absorb it and not crack. And like I mentioned, if it was a traditional resin, it would just shatter. The other thing that's very unique is you can see that I have the screw in here. We can actually run a screw into the G-Flex and it has enough flexibility to absorb that without actually putting a pilot hole in. We offer G-Flex in two versions, 650 and 655. So this first version, G-Flex 650, is our toughened epoxy. It has a viscosity similar to like honey. Then our thickened version, G-Flex 655 thickened epoxy adhesive, it has a consistency similar to like gel toothpaste. The mix ratio of G-Flex, actually both versions, is one to one by volume. It's actually easy to meter the correct ratio of just like one part resin to one part hardener. You can actually eyeball it to maintain the correct volume. It does have a working time of around 75 minutes at 72 degrees Fahrenheit. G-Flex is the perfect structural epoxy for those difficult to bond to applications, dissimilar materials, and applications that may experience shock or vibration.